Well, hello there everyone, David, your friendly hairy Scotsman here once again. Um, today I am going to be doing a little bit of cooking. Um, last night for my dinner, I wasn't really that hungry, but it was already up, all made and everything, so I put it away in the fridge. Um, never got around to eating it last night. So, tonight, that means I'm going to do something with it. Now, what it was, was... Frikadellen, some chips, onion rings. So what I decided to do was, I was out today, I've got some noodles, some crunchy bean sprouts and some sweet and sour sauce. So you can probably work out, I'm going to do a wee stir fry out of it all. So that could be interesting, it might turn out nice. It might be completely different. Who's to know? Until we try it. So I'll position this like so. Get that onto the chopping board. Zoom in a wee touch. In fact, turn it that way so it's a bit better. Now. What I'm going to do, I'm going to chop it up into bits, like so, that's what it's like inside, it's, well it's a German thing I think, so I'll chop it up into blocks, this should be quite good, all roughly the same size. This way. I like frikadellas, they're really good. Uh, you can put them on, you can eat them just normal like this, or you can pop them on a roll or on a wrap or whatever. All I know is that they are really nice. Splitting them all up into bits. Like that. That lot can sit up there just now. The onion rings, I'll chop them into bits. I absolutely love onion rings. I forgot to just sharpen that knife. Keep them separate. A little bit, like that. I can move up a wee bit. And I'll chop the chips. Like this, just a little bit. together quite nicely. Just about there, there's only a few more to do. I should have used the magic of YouTube but that didn't take long did it. So that's them all now pretty much ready. I'll move these over to the walk. Bit, so that's got a bit more strength. There we go. Touch. There we go. Let's get some heat under this. Wrong one. Okay, that's that on. Got a wee drop oil in the wok. Just sunflower oil I'm using. There we go. It's basic sunflower oil. That warms up a wee touch. Round and round it goes. It's quite a new walk as well, so. Right, 
ちの、あ、おいしゃするよね。はい。じゃ、let's grab the meat。Smell the frickadella and keep them out here. The spices that are coming out of it, that is really nice. And we'll throw in the onion rings. Let's see. Smells that are coming off this at the moment are just yummy. We give them a few seconds like that just to come to. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to rattle through these just now. So they're all nice and hot. I like a little bit of vinegar in my food just to throw the acidity a little bit. And I'll hold that till later, that bit. Smells absolutely amazing. I wish, I wish I had smelly vision. Just that is amazing. So what I'll do, I'm going to pull that out just now, if that is virtually ready like that, but we're not finished with it yet. Put that on there, like so, put that back on there, and into the, the noodles we go. Yeah, I'm quite selfish tonight, so they can all go in there. Try and separate these up a bit. They're a little bit dry in there, so we'll pop a wee bit more oil in. So that will stop it sticking to the bottom there. Like this. 
cook in some soy. I'm going to go finish the bottle off. There's not much in there. Let's get into the crunchy bean stripes. Ah, yum. Let's get these moving a bit. Oh, they are so crunchy. Hence the name, crunchy bean stripes. Nicely. Okay, I'll leave a bit of a chime in here. I absolutely love sweet and sour. And then, I think we know what's coming next. All this goes back in. And gets all stirred through. Once again, if we had smelly vision, this is amazing. And that is virtually it ready now. I don't think I'm going to bother putting the other one in. That's nicely covered. And you know what? That is it ready. So we're going to come back here a wee bit to the plate. Now I can turn off that. Like so. Oh, 
going to put that on just now. A couple of bits on the top like so. That lot can sit there for later. But you know what they say about having Chinese food. 20 minutes after you're finished you're hungry again so... There we go. Now, how does that look, eh? Let's go wide. Pop this up here like that. Now move this over a wee touch more. In fact, I'm just going to clear me a wee bit a sec. Like this. This can come over to here. Gives me a wee bit more space then. <sighs> wow. I tell you some folks, that's warm. So here we go. That could be my thumbnail. Let's try it. Mmm. Oh wow, that is so good. The taste, the, the flavours there. You can... You can still taste the fricadella in. You've got the onion and the onion rings coming through. Um, the sweet and sour, you can taste the pineapple and everything like that in it. It is absolutely wonderful, it's amazing. Um, that was leftovers from last night's dinner. Some noodles, some uh, bean sprouts, a little tub of uh, soy, or we dropped soy, some vinegar, and some sweet and sour sauce that I bought in. What did that take me to do? About six or seven minutes? That is just... Mm. That is just amazing. It's a lot cheaper than a takeaway. It took less time to make than it would to get delivered. That is fantastic. I'm so enjoying this. And I've got a feeling that I'll be coming back for seconds to finish that off and uh, sitting in the uh, walk there. Whew. I'm enjoying this. And I'm getting a free sauna off it as well. A free facial out of the, all the steam coming off it, all the heat. That is just yummy. The fricadella is still soft, a wee crispy edge to it where I put it through the pan again. There's a bit of chip. Yep, really nice. Onion ring. Lovely. And some of the bean sprouts and noodles. You cannot go wrong with something like that. So, I'm going to toddle off. I'm going to go and finish this just now. Hope everyone's keeping well. If you like my little videos here that I'm doing, really appreciate it if you hit the like button. If you're not already subscribed, um, if you hit the red button, hit the bell, YouTube might actually let you know that I'm putting more of these up. I'm trying to put as many as I can up. Uh, I'm doing between, I think it's about five and six a month at the moment somewhere in that region anyway um, I'm enjoying this not just the food just shooting these videos, it's good fun so I'm going to toddle just now as I said I hope you are all keeping well and fit take care of yourselves 
and hopefully I will see you at the next one that I do. Take care. See ya.